Hey everyone, welcome to another video of the Upsell WP plugin. And in this video, we're going to talk about creating cart upsells. Now, this is an amazing way for adding a few more items to your cart to elevate your shopping experience and potentially boost your average order value. Our cart upsell campaign is specifically designed to offer personalized product recommendations on the cart page, making your shopping session even more delightful. In this video, I'm going to show you how to provide a percentage discount on this cart upsell offer product, which is a beanie with logo when a customer adds a t-shirt to their cart. All right. So for this, this is going to be a conditional cart upsell. So let's see how to do that by going to the WordPress dashboard first and then to the plugins dashboard. As you can find here, get to the campaigns tab and start creating the campaign. Let's click on create new campaign and select cart upsells to be the campaign type and start off by giving a campaign name. I'm going to call this cart upsells sample. Next comes the offer section. The first one you can see in the offer section is the display location at cart page. You can choose where exactly this particular cart upsell should appear either at the top of the cart page or before cart items table or after etc i will go for the default one next comes the display method this applies when you have multiple upsell offers added to the same campaign right now i'm just going to create one but please know that you can create up to five upsell offers in a single campaign interesting isn't it now let's see how to add an offer product this is the upsell product that we're going to display on the cart page so let's click on add offer and select the offer product. As I told you, it's going to be beanie with logo. Then comes the quantity section. Before moving to it, you can see on the right, there's this preview where you can take a look at how cart upsells appear on the cart. Nice, isn't it? You have two options there, desktop and mobile view, which is also going to be helpful. Next comes the quantity section here. You can either leave it empty or give options for your customers to choose their quantities or go for a fixed one. That's what it means. I will leave it empty, meaning customers can select their own quantities. Next comes discount type and value. You can choose to give no discount or free or fixed discount or percentage discount for this particular upsell offer. As discussed, we're going to give 10% on this particular card upsell product. So let me choose percentage discount and set the value to 10. Next comes usage limit. This applies in different ways. The first one is overall usage limit, which talks about the usage limit for the particular campaign. So if you set one here, it means that the campaign will run only once and then it works no more. Next comes usage limit per customer. So this, if you set one here, it means each customer can run this campaign only once after which it won't function for them anymore. All right. So I'm not going to set any. You also have options to customize the look and feel of this cart up cells. For that, you will have to go to this template contents. And here you have offer title. You can edit it as you want. Here are some short codes that you have to keep so that the particular value is retrieved. You can see 10% shown here because of the short code. Otherwise, you can edit whatever you want. Next comes offer CDA text. You can also go for something like grab this offer. Something like that. And then you can also change the product image. For more customization options, you could go for template styling and change the template. Right now it looks like this. Let's click on change template and see what we have. We have something like this, this and this. Uh, kind of like this one. So let me select that template. Then comes custom styling. You can also style this particular uh, look and feel by clicking on enable and changing whatever you want. Let me go for slightly greenish one here. Great. Now let's save this particular setting so that the settings are reflected properly. Likewise, you could add up to five upsell offers in a single campaign. Now, in the beginning of the video, I said we're going to offer 10% off on this particular upsell product if customers add a t-shirt. So this is a conditional upselling. In this case, we'll have to click on add condition and make sure that this particular cart upsell is presented to customers only if they purchase a t-shirt. 
for this let me click on choose a condition and from the drop down you can select whatever is suitable for you in this case i'm going to select products in the cart and the product that must be present in the cart in order for uh, this card upsell to appear is going to be t-shirt with logo now let's save you can notice the condition set here rest of the things are just the same priority this applies if you have multiple campaigns running at a time and then start date and end date which applies for scheduling these campaigns for a certain time period all right now let's save and close this particular offer and see what it looks like on the storefront the campaign is active so let's move to the storefront now remember the qualifying product for the upsell to appear is a t-shirt with logo so let's go add this product to the card and then here on the card page you're presented with the upsell offer now all that customers need to do is grab this deal by clicking on add to cart and you will notice that the upsell product is added to the cart with a 10 percent off and this is how it works don't miss out on this wonderful opportunity get the upsell wp plugin today and start creating personalized cart upsells for your valued customers thank you so much for watching happy upselling